Welcome back to my YouTube tutorial in a quick and very very quick one I'm just going to show you how to use pen tool in Photoshop and and on this particular Photoshop feature called pen tool a whole lot of people have problem with that and it's very easy to use so let's just go to Photoshop and let's see what we can do pen tool pen tool yes for this particular destiny is over here that particular tool is here and we call it pen tool and the pen tool is used to sketch you can use it to sketch you can use it to draw you can use it to do a whole lot of things in photoshop and when you are doing a uh, digital painting you can also use it when you are drawing something you can also do it you can also use it if you are also sketching some shape or anything you can use also use this pen tool to do that so however let's just pick our pen tool over here and I'll show you how to do it so however you can see that the distance over here is not you cannot see the pen tool but you can see a plus when a such thing happens all what you need to do it means that your caps lock is on so you just have to off it then when you off it you have this kind of thing over there so there is the pen tool so how do you use pen tool sometimes using pen tool is not that difficult but if you are a, a, a beginner you have some a little bit problem about that but all what you need to do is to just be understand what I am going to tell you you want to draw shape over there that looks so distant on there this particular document however how do you do that what you need to do is that you have to come and click either here or here no problem but if you want to draw something like a line so all what you need to do is to come and click over here then you hold shift to draw to click over here too so when you do that you see that you will have a what a straight line very straight line when you hold what shift you have a straight line so on the, doing this you have just draw something like that over like just like that and you can also come over here then you bring it over here so that you have just draw something like that in photoshop so this is the use of pencil however you want to do some kind of shapeless or shape a uh, pen tool in this matter so however let's see the, uh, the the properties of using the pen tool over the top over there pen tool you can use path and you can use shape you get that and you can also make selection you can mask you can add shape and a whole lot of this thing over here too you can also use it combining the shapes subtracting the front shape intersect shape areas and exclude overlapping shapes you can also do that and over here too you can also use alignment left align right align and those kind of things and spacing too you can also do that and over here too you can those shape that you are creating you can also bring them front bring them forward bring them back and on all that you can also do that and over here too there is also a settings that you can also get over here too you want the shape to be rubber band it, it will, should be rounded you can also click on this particular distance and it's going to be like that so however let's come and click over here then we go to shape because i want the shape to appear so that you can understand what i really mean so however i just want to draw some shape on this particular document so all what i need to do is to come and click over here one and then i'll come and click over here and hold the left what the left button when i click the second i'll hold the left what button and when i hold the left button i'll just move my mouse just like this so that i'll have some kind of shape just like that okay yes i'll have something like that and you can also come and click over here and then hold and have it just like this over here over here over here over here and you come and close it up so this is how i have just draw a shape very simple one let me just delete everything again and let's get it done so however and yet i'm just going to delete it uh just like this and draw another one so all what you need to do is to click one that's your first thing for the first time cleaning clicking don't hold just click once and then the next thing when you are clicking then you hold and click you get that or you click and hold how you just do it so then you can have it just like this then you click over here and hold two then you click over here and hold then you click over here and hold then you bring it to the starting point so this is the starting point and when you bring it you see that zero will come at on the pen tool but when you leave it you won't get the zero 
but when you, you see that then you click on that so it means that there is the end point and there is the what the starting point then you can have something like this this is shape and on that particular shape too you can change the color to any color that you like you get that yes so there is no matter how pen tool is being used in photoshop and however you can also import in a picture and you can also use that this particular picture to do what to remove a background so you, you can also use the pen tool to remove a an image background so let's just click on that then let me zoom out my work then i'll just click over here then i'll come and click over here just to select the edge of my this thing over there just like that just like that okay just like this then over here over that over that so the for tutorial say i am just going to fast forward this thing and you will see how i just want to fast forward it and then i'll clip through all this thing then you see so let's just see just keep watching as you can see you can see that i have just changed the image to black by adding a shape to it just like this you get that and when i close it this is what i'm, I'm going to have and when i on it up this is what i'm going to have so however when i have something like that all what i need to do is to change it to what to a shape yes i am just going to change it to a shape by changing it to a shape is is nothing by holding control enter and that one will change to a shape like this then i can close up that particular shape and this is what is selected then after the when this is done i'll just come and add a, a layer mask to it so that the background is going to remove and leave the everything you get that sorry okay so i just have to click on this particular this thing then i'll add layer marks to it just like this as you can see the background has just gone like that so using the pen tool you can also use the pen tool to remove the background is and it's going to look so beautiful and so nice as you want you see that and any part of the image tool you can use the pen tool to do that however I, let me just remove this particular this thing then you'll understand it very well so we are removing uh, over there over there just like this okay so just keep your eye on that and i want you to master it anytime you are using it you can use it everywhere you like so you can have something like that then we can have something like this over here then i'll have it like this then the next thing again i have to do is to hold control and press enter then it will give you a shape like this and however all what you need to do over over, over this place you right click it and convert it to smart objects then you right click again and rasterize it and when that one is done all what you need to do is to press ctrl j to duplicate it then when you duplicate it it means that you can have only the head over there just like that okay so that is how we do we normally do cutting when it come when we are doing digital painting that we are going to still do in photoshop digital painting to make your picture look beautiful so you can use the pen tool to cut off every part even the cutting of the eye you can also use the pen tool to cut off the eye over there just like that and then you can just cut off every part of the uh, 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 the human being parts uh, either the eye or any part you can do that in photoshop by using the what by using the, the pen tool over there and it's going to look so beautiful yes so let's have it just like that and you can see that i've just closed up the eye and i can also do the same thing like pressing ctrl enter and that one will be selected and over there i'll just do what ctrl g to remove the only the eye over there then i can have something like this as you can see there is the eye over there so this is how pen tool has been used in photoshop so uh, using pen tool is not something difficult and you can also use it to draw any kind of shape that you like in photoshop without any uh, problem you get that yes and you just have to be mastered in this particular distance as you are drawing the shape and you know doing any kind of shape that you like in photoshop is very good when you are using this particular pen tool to do yes. so thank you very much for watching this is abm graphics and have a nice day bye bye